nothing will come if you don't sacrifice. You have to really ask yourself what you're asking for. And I think when I started to have those humble conversations with myself, it's like, bro, what do you really want? Yeah. And yeah. I, I, when I settled on like, all right, bro, you want to be a professional? This is what it's going to take. And I was yeah. like, ah. all right, you want to be the best college? This is what it's going to take. Yeah. Uh, you want to be the best at your school? This one take. Yeah, 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 I can do that one. And, you know, course. so it's like just figuring out what you really want, and then being realistic with yourself. If you don't have good expectations or you don't mitigate, you're gonna be miserable. Totally. And I think it's very easily for athletes to be miserable and fall yep. prone to like things like depression, like anxiety. Mm -hmm. There's so many things I have to deal with as a college athlete that, yep. you know, I'm just learning to deal with better now. I saw a crazy cover on, on YouTube that I was like, I, without even watching it, I already know what he's about to talk about. It was Carmelo Anthony who's like, I'm still a champion, like even without the rings without or something. Ring, yeah. And I, because he's like, he found peace. He found peace in that sport and he can't leave that sport without finding peace or you're gonna be bitter you're gonna be sorry but if I if I had set my goal like all right if I don't become an Olympian out of college I'm not happy then what would have happened yeah, yeah. no matter what I accomplished if I didn't accomplish that I would have not been happy